Hello and welcome back to another video on the channel where this time I'm talking about five wingers uh, who I think uh, could play as a uh, well a center in the NHL. Uh, these are just my opinions so uh, I could be spectacularly uh, wrong in your opinion but uh, yeah let me know your thoughts in the comments and yeah without a further ado uh, the reason why I'm doing this video uh, is the first player that I'm gonna mention here. These are in no particular order. Uh, the first player will be uh, obviously this player Patrick Laine who well he well he managed to play a couple games as a center and then he didn't because uh, well uh, he got injured and yeah, uh, bad luck for him. Uh, he has uh, been a bit of an injury prone in last couple of seasons. Uh, hopefully uh, that doesn't happen in the next season as well. Uh, at least it uh, looks like his season might be over at this point. But yeah, I thought uh, he played a couple games as a center. He played quite well. Uh, maybe he could do that in future, uh, play as a center instead of a uh, winger. At least he's got a good size and, uh, well, he can uh, pass the puck, even though uh, people always focus on his shooting ability. Uh, but yeah, uh, first player that I want to mention here uh, is Laine, and uh, he is the biggest player out of these. So, uh, well, maybe I should have uh, picked more uh, taller players, but uh, my players that I pick here... Uh, aren't uh, necessarily the tallest but uh, maybe good two-way players and passers uh, which I think could uh, benefit the center position although this next player has more goals this season than uh, uh, well uh, assists or yeah Owen Tippett uh, yeah he has played uh, quite well for uh, Philadelphia this season uh, as I said, uh, well, I didn't, uh, I don't know if I said uh, the actual points, but I believe he has 40 points uh, this season. Uh, former Florida first round pick, uh, doing quite well with, uh, with Philadelphia this season. And uh, yeah, uh, this season he has had a 62.1% uh, playoff, uh, not playoff, but a face of rating. So I think that's pretty impressive for a winger. and. Yeah, maybe Tibet could, uh, he has had a good season, maybe he could be a good center in the future. At this point he is listed as a winger, but yeah, maybe he could do a good job as a center uh, in the future years, uh, which hopefully he has many left in the NHL. Uh, then a uh, Carolina player that I've got here is Finnish player uh, Devo Teravainen. Uh, and yeah, I just think uh, this season uh, he has been good uh, in face-offs, uh, well, at least quite solid, uh, 63% uh, for a, a winger, and it's not just uh, one face-off. He has had quite many this season, so yeah, he's 28 years old, but maybe he could uh, be played as a center, I don't know. Uh, obviously, uh, Carolina, they have many players who could play at center, so... Uh, yeah, I'm sure if he's ever gonna be played there, uh, they have Aho, uh, Stahl can play there, Kotkaniemi, others, so uh, yeah, I don't really know if he's ever gonna play as a center, but I think he could, could do a solid job there, obviously uh, not the tallest player, but uh, still he's a good passer and yeah, uh, plus 12 uh, rating this season, so he's pretty solid in both ends, I would think, and yeah, maybe he could play as a center in the future. Maybe it's Carolina, maybe with the other team, I don't know. But uh, yeah, that's just my take. Uh, you can let me know your thoughts. Uh, then New Jersey. Uh, this player is one that might be uh, playing as a center uh, more regularly. But I still consider him uh, as a winger at this point. Uh, but it's a young player. Dawson Mercer, a uh, young uh, player, 25, uh, 21-year-old uh, player for uh, New Jersey. Uh, yeah, as I said, I think he, well, he could play as center already, but uh, maybe uh, in future years, uh, obviously, Hughes and Hisher uh, will play 
Yeah, the centers, uh, but uh, maybe third line center, uh, but uh, yeah, maybe a first or second line winger is better position for him. But I think he could do a good job as a center in NHL. And yeah, uh, this season uh, his face of present hasn't been that great. Only something like 42 or something uh, like that. But uh, yeah, I think he could do a good job uh, as a center and uh, he can uh, pass the puck as well, uh, quite well. And he is still young, so, uh, but uh, New Jersey, they already have Hughes and his year as a center man. So maybe he's not needed there, maybe more as a winger uh, as he has played most of the season. But uh, yeah, and the last player, uh, Toronto Maple Leafs. Uh, I'm not sure how people will respond to this, but uh, or how you think about this. But William Nylander, uh, he has played quite well this season, uh, 81 points in 71 games. Uh, yeah, I just think uh, he could be a good center, uh, but the situation is same with uh, many of these teams. Uh, that yeah, uh, he probably is more needed uh, as a winger because Matthews Tavares. Now Ryan O'Reilly, even though he's injured uh, right now, but uh, yeah, I think still uh, William Nylander could do a good job uh, as a centerman. Uh, but yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think about my choices? Uh, obviously, there are more players uh, that could play as a centerman. Uh, maybe Dawson Mercer, he could be, uh, well, he could be a centerman uh, by uh, some people already, but uh, yeah, uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments. What do you think about my choices and uh, who do you think could play as a centerman uh, from a winger position? And hit the like and subscribe for more uh, hockey and NHL content. And have a nice day.